Hey guys, how are you? Since I'm going to wash my hair tonight, I decided to show you guys how I pre-poo. Now, this is the way I do it. So, you know, um, I do add a lot of oils to my pre-poo. So, it's up to you if you want to add as much oil as I do or if you want to add less. But I'm just going to show you guys what I use. Um, this time I'm going to use my I'll, um, Organic Roof Stim uh, sorry, can't talk right now. Organic Roof Stimulator Olive Oil Replenish and Conditioner. And for some of you guys, it also comes in the packs too. So this is what I do. I have a bow and I have like a little spatula. So I'm gonna pour in my bow. Right now, I'm almost, I need you to relax my hair every three months, and I believe I'm about two months and a half. So my hair has a lot of new growth, so I kind of need a good amount of this right now. Now, after I've done that, I use, I have about, let me see, two, four, six essential oils that I add. Usually, I do about four to five drops. This is eucalyptus oil. You just have it like this, and you just add the drops. I'm going to say about four drops four drops of eucalyptus I do four drops of rosemary I also do four drops of lavender And I do four drops of peppermint. I also do four drops of along along. Hopefully I'm pronouncing it right. This one smells really good. And I also have this neem oil. It's like an Indian oil. That one I usually do maybe like a drop or two because it's very strong. And it has like the dropper. So I try to do like a drop or two. One, two. Because this one is very, very strong. So you don't want to put too much. Now at the same time, I also put a little bit of Mega Thief Growth Oil by Do Grow. And this is the one that is no mineral oil and no petroleum. Just a little bit of that. And I usually put a little bit of my amla oil. This is from the Indian shop. Now I do about a drop or two of my Indian oils. This one is Shikakai. This one is Brahmi Amla. Just a drop or two. And this one is Muhammad Barrage. And last but least. I always add a little bit of my Jamaican black castor oil to everything. Pretty, pretty well, all my peoples. Now you just mix everything up. I know some of you might think, oh wow, this is a lot of oils that you know she's using. But to be honest with you, I started my hair journey at the end of January, and so far that's been working for me. And my hair is much thicker than what I start out with. Hopefully, once I... My goal right now for the end of the year is bra strap. Right now, I'm between... Um, hmm, I'm past shoulder length, definitely. Hopefully, I can put some pictures up, you know, maybe later on, later off the month or before the summer ends of what my hair is or what my hair used to be. I used to have real long, thick, healthy hair, but I also used to like to dye and color my hair. And the biggest mistake is that I dye my hair a honey brown and then the second time around, 
I dyed it using the booster and the booster had damaged my hair I mean my hair was just stripped and was just dried and breaking and split ends everywhere so I had cut it about ear length and basically January after watching Athea and a whole bunch of other girls on YouTube I decided to start a hair journey and decided I was gonna grow my hair back and like I said this might be a lot to you but for me this works for me so you just you know mix it up and you can tell it's not even you know it's not even that liquidy it's real still thick sometimes like I said because right now I'm about two and a half months and I usually perm my I mean sorry not perm well relax my hair every three months so I usually do have to add a good amount because my hair is kind of thick right now and I have a lot of new growth so you just keep mixing it becomes like this really nice I don't want to pour it on the laptop but it becomes like this really I don't know if you guys can see it this really nice and creamy and after that you just part your hair as if you were putting a relaxer and you distribute this among you know your whole hair massage it in and I usually leave my pre poos for anywhere from an hour to like two hours before I wash my hair because today I'm gonna shampoo wash my hair and I'm also gonna do my black tea rinse now if you guys keep up with um, Nuna and Tracy, you can see, you know, they have videos to show you how to, you know, do your black tea rinse. Because each of them do it slightly different. So, I actually like to shampoo my hair, put do the black tea rinse, leave it in my hair for 15-20 minutes, and then apply my conditioner. And I believe that's the way Tracy does it. I actually like that. I've been doing the black tea rinses for about two weeks now. This will be my third week. And... I didn't have a lot of shedding since I started my hair journey, but I have noticed with the black tea rinse, my hair does not shed at all. Like, it really doesn't shed that much. So, I'm going to try to do the black tea rinse once a week right now till I get a relaxer and, you know, see what happens, see what my results are. So, um, this video was just to show you how I do my pre poo Remember, this is how I do it. What I do might not work for you, but it works for me. It works for my hair. I tried different things and different techniques before I finally found what worked for me. So you can play around with your oils. You can add some oils, take some oils out, you know. You don't have to add as much oils as I do. But like I said, this works for my hair. And you can look at my hair right now. It's very thick. And also, when I had dyed my hair, it had stripped. Like right here was bald. Like I had no hair in the middle of my hair. And you can see how it's starting to fill up right now it's coming in lovely so much thick I mean before I couldn't even go like this cuz I pretty much had no hair on the top of my head like that's how bad the booster had you know tear off my hair so this is what's working for me and I just wanted to show you guys what I you know what I add to my pre -poos. I rotate like I said between the ORS and between the Alasta um, QP DPR 11 and also between the lustrous silk no not lustrous silk um is it lustrous silk something like that share butter well thanks for watching guys i'll talk to you later